So this is the Poco F1, the new flagship killer with an unusual pricing. This is the official Indian retail unit that I bought in the first flash sale. The Poco F1 comes packed within a sweet black and yellow box which I think is quite minimal and looks different. Inside the box you will get this yellow paper compartment where you will find some paperwork and starting guide with a good quality silicon case. The premium mid-range market is fast becoming one of the most aggressive in mobile. Companies such as OnePlus with its OnePlus 6 highlight the appeal of high-end specs at a lower price. But now, new player Poco is taking things to extreme with the new Poco F1. Inside you will find an 18W Qualcomm Quick Charge 3.0 compatible fast charger and a USB Type-C cable. That's it. The headline feature here is the use of Qualcomm's best mobile platform, the Snapdragon 845. It is the same unit you will find inside every flagship from Sony Xperia XZ2 to the Samsung Galaxy S9. What's more, Poco has managed to squeeze in a liquid cooling system, unheard of in the affordable smartphone space. Depending on where you pick up the F1, it also packs generous amount of RAM in either 6GB or 8GB configuration. On paper, it's almost as though this phone has been specifically designed to serve the likes of OnePlus 6. It matches the former in terms of processor and memory allocation, as well as running on a foundation of Android Oreo 8.1 with an upgrade to Android 9.0 Pie promised within 3 months of the launch. So this is my OnePlus 6 which I have been using since a month and this is the Poco F1. So let's compare. Now my OnePlus 6 has the latest and greatest SoC that is the Snapdragon 845 and this Poco F1 also has the same. Hmm. My OnePlus 6 has face unlock which is really fast and accurate. But this Poco F1 has a better mechanism with infrared sensor and this will unlock my device even in dark situations. Impressive. Poco F1 has a 4000mAh battery as compared to 3300mAh on my OnePlus 6 which at least in theory should last more than OnePlus 6. Poco F1 has this system called liquid cooling that is set to improve my gaming experience. Whoa, that sounds cool. I guess I started liking this device. I know the device doesn't look as premium as OnePlus 6 due to its polycarbonate build. But hey, most of us do use a plastic case or a skin on our expensive and so-called premium glass build devices like OnePlus 6, S9 Plus or iPhone 10 just to add some protection, right? But I think this Poco F1 doesn't need that. So guys, is Poco F1 better than OnePlus 6? Well, that's a thousand dollar question and I will be trying to test every aspect of these two devices to determine which one has better value for money. So if you don't want to miss on those videos, then do consider subscribing and hit the bell icon so that you never miss any future videos from Extreme Droid. So this is Samir signing off and I'll see you guys in my next one.